Hello everybody, Ultra Mario here, and I'm back at it again with more Mickey Mania, this time on the Sega Genesis instead of the Super Nintendo or the PlayStation 1. We're gonna see the differences in this version and how better I am or worse. And also there's a hidden level apparently that I didn't get in the PlayStation 1 version, so there is also that. Make that easy. Okay. Start the game. Oh. I didn't mean to skip the animation, so let's just get to it real quick. No. Okay. Damn it. No, I'm trying to reset it. Too fast. Okay. There. Okay. No skipping animation. We're gonna see Mickey doing his thing. And how cool it is. Because I don't remember this in the other versions, actually. Probably was in the PlayStation version, but uh, I don't know. It wasn't in the Super Nintendo. Oh, wow. That is a cool effect. It wasn't in the Super Nintendo for some reason. We're gonna make fun of that version. Because... Like, bruh, there's a lot more effects here. The camera's moving and stuff, I don't know if it did that. Also, Mickey, it talks a lot more, I think. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, the Genesis version feels pretty smooth. But they all pretty much control exactly the same, so... Like, there is not much gameplay difference between all of the versions. Oh, bro, why do the freaking pipes hit you? Ugh. No matter what, the difficulty is gonna be a problem, so... Kill, kill the cat. Okay. Kill the dang cat. Okay, whatever. I just wanted to kill the cat. Bro, is it me or is Mickey more talkative in this version? You just like, get hit and he's just like, ow, ow. I don't know. Mickey, just, just be quiet, bro. Animations are just as bouncy as any other version. And I gotta say, music pretty decent in this one. They're all, all pretty good in each version, but... It sounds good in this one, too. I'm not sure if I have a favorite. I mean, I don't particularly like the music, like, a ton as, like, a favorite in any of the versions, but it's good. It's decent. Oh my god. Ugh. Okay, getting hit is so annoying. Mickey! Don't get hit by the damn parrot! Oh yeah, I have the weapon things. Oh wow, that's satisfying with the button config I put for this. Okay, go Michael. Damn it. It's too high. Okay, I'm only getting that one. Pretty basic tutorial level, but... Bruh. I don't want to make me going for that random star for nothing, okay? Stupid parrot. I like the sounds. They sound fun in this version. Got that Genesis twanginess to the sounds. The, the crunchiness. Just kill peanut. Bro, just die. Oh yeah, jumping on him doesn't do anything, I think. Bro, stop spinning your 
Whatever the heck that is at me. I, I never knew what that was in the short, so... Wait, am I supposed to, like... Oh, right. Duh. I remember now. I have to go this way, and then I gotta wait for Pete. Right? I, I think. He's not coming. Oh, there he is. Oh my god. I'm spending like 10 minutes just on level 1. There's no way I'm gonna beat the game in time. I don't know if I'll try to beat the game on this stream like I did the other one. But we'll see. I'm positive I'll do pretty good at least. I mean, I played the game like 10 other times. Not really. More like 2, but. Cubes are just as impressive as any other version, though. It's like 3D, bro. How do they do that? I feel like animation-wise, this game is more technically impressive than Toy Story. Oh yeah, this song is definitely better than the other version. Wow, it's five hits on each gear. Damn, ow. Who is controlling this contraption, and why is it here? Okay, I feel like the bombs are, like, more crazy. Okay, one more. One more. I'm, I'm doing better than in this NES version. Like, I was, like, dying a lot. Okay, just move this. There we go. Got him. Mr. Steamboat Man himself. We got him, boys. Um, where's my phone? I don't know, I'll get it after this level, honestly. The Mad Doctor. I hate this level, no matter what. No matter what version, no matter what, you know, thing. This is the worst. Bro. The bats don't die in one hit? They should. Oh boy, it's the funny skeletons. I hope they don't try to murder me with their bones. You know what? Just, just run. I, I don't even... No. What? Okay. Wow, I sure hope the scatter of their bones attacking me doesn't kill me. Wait. What? So, is, is their attack pattern, like, way less annoying in this game? In this version? Because when I kill them in the other game, they specifically, like, scatter in an annoying pattern. Here, I just have to go in the middle. I'm pretty sure it's different. Yeah, it's a lot easier to dodge somehow. I'm not sure if that if the easy mode is just broken on the other ones, or I don't know, but it's better somehow. Yeah, that is so much better. How did they mess that up on the other versions? What did they think? It was too easy to dodge? They were like, yeah, let's be an asshole. I'm gonna make the bones scattered everywhere. Scatter everywhere and kill Mickey. Like, good on you. You wanted to kill a rat, man. I, d I don't know. I don't want to get hit by the fire, so. Yeah. I'm gonna die. 
Also, no loading times in this version, like, at all. I didn't even mention that. But, that's insane. Like, they have it on the Super Nintendo, somehow, even though that's, like, also a cartridge system. Sega CD and PlayStation 1 I get, they might need loading times, because discs are slower, in general, but... Like, why would a cartridge game need loading to load anything? Of older hardware, I mean, like... <laughs> like, obviously, a Switch game's gonna need to load, but... I don't know any loading times in DS games, for example. Or GBA games, because, like, that's weird. Okay. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, you know what? Let Mickey die. Also, the music here is, like, really good, actually. It's just this- this- this part- oh wait, this is annoying, but... Whatever, it's short. Also, I feel like the control is a lot smoother here. So it's easier to actually, like, do the thing they want me to do. I don't know how, it's just better. Like, I'm not sure if it's just because I'm better at this version- better because I played the game a bunch, but like... Like, you see me? I'm flawlessly not getting hit by any of these obstacles. Except for that one. But, like, that- I told you about- Okay. Okay, so, what I thought was, the PlayStation version added this section. No, actually, I just think the Super Nintendo version removed it. So, yeah, this- this stupid stair session I hate so much is in this version, and the PlayStation version. That- that's what it is, so... Yeah. I guess I'll have to deal with it. I don't remember the bats, though. I feel like the layout was completely different in the PlayStation. What? How? Okay, whatever. Bro. Bro fell through that somehow. Bro. What is happening? Is that not climbable stairs? Okay. Apparently, if you fall from the top... Onto the lower part of the level, that doesn't count? I d Bro, logic. You can't take shortcuts. Bro, this game's annoying! Wait, what? Sorry. One sec. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's still easier than the PS1 version, somehow. I mean, then again, it was, might have been because I, you know, didn't play the game at all, but... I feel- I just feel like this part is different, somehow. Maybe the barrel patterns are like yeah, the ba- the barrels were bouncing in the PlayStation, I'm pretty sure. That's what it was. Wait, wait, wait? How? What am I supposed to do here? So you're telling me the game's just screwing me over here? What? No. What? No. Bro. Okay, this section still sucks, no matter what you're going on. You, you gotta be kidding me. This sucks. Okay. I only have two lives. Because the game was like, don't take any shortcuts. Okay, I have to go straight forward, and not die to barrels and bats. The impressive 3D barrels, yes, but they still are suck. And I got hit and died, so that's- that's fun. Oh wait, dude, this says Mario Kart Tour, I am an idiot, okay. Mickey Mania. Mickey Mania. It's not Mario Kart Tour. Okay, hold up. Let me make sure it says Mario- uh, Mickey Mania. 
It's Mickey Mania. Okay, and then I'll have to change it after the stream is done, because it reverts back to the first game that was played, and not the last one. But that's fine. It's, as long as it says Mickey Mania now, I don't care. Okay, Mouse, let's speed run it down the stairs. Rodent. There. It's all because I missed one step. Phenomenal game design. Yeah, no, that literally is easier than the other versions. 100%. The bones don't scatter. <laughs> I don't know why they messed that up. Why they decided it. it was to make it harder. But they, uh, you know, that's that's stupid. This, uh, honestly, the Genesis version is the best one so far. Just because of these difficulty adjustments that are here that don't exist in the other versions. Like, I swear, it's so much easier, somehow. Like, actually easier. When I pick easy, I want the game to be easier, okay? It's still a challenging, but it's much less frustrating for certain things so far. Like, I don't know, lower the hit at enemies, too. Make it so it's like two hits for the bat, or one. Why should a bat last three hits? Like, every- uh, Bro, what? What? Can't even see that bat. Okay, whatever. It's fine. We're just gonna go through and not get killed. Finally. Skeletons that don't hit me. Of course, there's still the surprise enemy moment. Ah, oh, okay. Goddamn bats. Actually, I think there's a trope with that exact name. Goddamn bats. GD bats. Don't care. Okay, I should be in the elevator section, right? Yeah. Actually, this is where I need to get to a secret in the game, but I don't know if I can get it. How do I avoid that? I still don't know. Okay. Bruh. They are here killing the mouse. The mouse man. Okay, you know what? Fine. Service level. I don't know how to avoid them! Okay. Oh, 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 I dodged. I dodged. I dodged. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it. Wait. Can I go out of here? No? Okay. Mickey, go! Mickey! You got this! Mr. Mouse! Secret. Whoa. Okay, that is really cool. Especially for a game this old. I have secrets like that? Dang, bro. I mean, okay, that isn't that mind-blowing. Old games have secrets all the time, but dang. Bro. Bro. 
secret Mickey Mouse. Bro, that is so cool. Okay. So he'll help out with the final battle. Okay, I got this. I'm on make <laughs> Yeah, excuse me. talks in this one. Super Nintendo doesn't have sounds, but I don't think I know any games on the Super Nintendo with voice acting, so fair enough. I don't know, man. Okay, we're gonna fight the Mad Doctor now. Even the flasks are harder, are easier to dodge in this version. This is actually playable! Bro, the game is actually playable this time. What did I do? I don't know, but they made him playable. I can actually dodge his attack. I mean, then again, I feel like I kind of could in the PlayStation version. And it really... Okay, it's still hard to dodge, don't get me wrong. But... No, it's easier. It definitely is easier to dodge. I say as I get hit like 10 times. You mostly just gotta stay on the platform. Oh my god, this sucks. Okay, never mind. Screw the Mad Doctor. It doesn't matter what version. He sucks. on the blocks. That's it. Also, he does not turn into a baby in this version either. For so, sadly. Oh boy, I got to play my b favorite level in gaming of all time. Moose Hunters from Mickey Mania. Uh, yeah. You know, I, I skipped the intro, but I don't. I don't. I honestly don't care. I, I don't care. I was gonna say, Moose Hunters is better? No, it's not. Of course it's not. I still get hit by a fr freaking branch I don't even know is there. But the rocks are easier to dodge, somehow. The moose is still just as fast and relentless as it is in other versions. If you're not ready, then screw you. Literally the worst level ever. Why did they make this? 
This is a platform game. Stop making me dodge stupid branches. Let me, pl like, platform? See, this is the saddest excuse for a level in a platform game I've ever seen, honestly. Like, at least try. The only cool gimmick is the moose comes randomly, and he's like, oh, it got a jump. But, like, otherwise, it's just, you dodge this falling thing. Wow. That's sure is level design. Like, bruh. I've complained about it enough, but, like, damn, bro, it does not get better. The third time I play it. I also wonder how this secret level will fare in my rankings. Oh, okay. Only thing I can think of is the rocks are easier to dodge, but then the moose comes. So, like... Oh my god! Okay. Mickey, I swear to god! Okay. Okay, thank god the level isn't that long. That's the one thing I'll give it points for. Oh, oh, okay, okay. It looks basically the same as the Super Nintendo did with the... But, wait, the apples are literally all just in a row. So I can just grab them all at once instead of... I guess the easy mode has actual differences here. Like, it actually is easy. As they claim. Cause like, I feel like Super Nintendo Easy Mode just felt like almost the same game. I didn't notice any difference between that PlayStation version. Like here, I can collect the apples. They're, they're there. Like I don't have to blindly guess where they are. Bruh. I mean, okay, that's a little too easy, but like, I don't care. Yeah, I probably don't really have to do anything here. Go, Mickey, go. You're going through Animal Crossing world with the moving planet. Oh, no, no, that's not fair. You can't do that. Oh, that's the finish line. Actually, no, and the level's over. Okay. Well, that's cool, I guess. Lonesome ghost. Honestly, I could put the game, like, a tiny bit louder, maybe. I don't know. I feel like it's tiny. It's, it's a little quiet. Make it negative 14.2. Yes! Actually, just die, Mickey. Like, genuinely die. Uh, I don't know, man. We're gonna beat this, though. I, I have faith. We only have two more levels. Well, two and a half, I guess, but... I am getting faster and my Mickey Mini are running. We are on level four now.
Yeah, like every other version, Mickey just keeps jumping if you hold B for some reason. I don't know why he does that, but whatever. I've never seen a platformer with this feature. I don't know why it would be even needed. Like, why? Okay, at least the collision is better than Super Nintendo. Again, downgrade. I'm not clipping through the floor this time. On these moving platforms. G good job, game. Thank you for not doing that. Damn. Um, okay. Not sure how to get by. Wait, shit. Okay. I wanna get that heart. Star thing. Not heart. Bro, let me get the damn star. Okay. You know what? Bro, it's too slow. I'm just gonna keep going. Bro, that is so hard to dodge. Bro. I have had it up to here with the game. You know what? Whatever, man. If I die... Mickey freaking dies. I, I don't know what to tell you. Like, the star is way too hard to get. Way too hard. Bro, this goddamn ghost. Okay. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be right back. I need to get my phone. Boop. back okay um here how do how do I avoid it Bruh, is this ghost impossible to dodge? No, but he is extremely annoying. Okay. The drums in this song are like, bopping. Okay, I'm gonna turn it down a bit again. Um, 16, negative 16, that'll, that'll do. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. Perfect volume control, I think. Oh. I think it would be a lot better if I could see ahead of me. Just saying. Like, I don't know why they need that, other than, oh, cool, spooky. But, like, they didn't think it through. The level's not really well designed around this element at all. Also, those damn man pipe covers. Honestly, I like the beanstalk level better than this. This is just annoying. I mean, at least I had some cool parts. And not annoying, like, enemy hit detection. What is- what- what is this? Oh my god, stop! Okay, there.
Crap. Bro, this part. Where you literally have to charge into enemies to get through. There's literally no option. Like, why? Okay, Michael, you, you got this, dude. Bop in here. I feel like it's a dark somehow. Oh well. Oh no, it's just like. Okay, so it, maybe it was like that in every version with the barrel just sinking. For no reason, by the way. I just. I don't like that. Why does it do that? No. You know what? This, this game sucks. Uh, no. It's not good. I like it, but it's also like really annoying. I've never experienced such things with the game. Where, like, I like it, but it just isn't fun. Like, how is that possible? How do you make a game I don't like, but I also like? To such a degree. You have this Mickey Mouse game. For reference, it's a bunch of classic shorts. Has perfect ideas. Like, okay, I'm gonna play in the levels. Based on the shorts. Like, that's... A genius idea. Mickey Mouse, Mickey, Epic Mickey did that well too. And then you have this game. Uh, I have amazing ideas, but horrible execution. Like, why would you do any of this? This game is just like not fun somehow. Like, I don't, I don't know. I won't say it's a great game or even a good one. I don't know. It's, it's a pretty decent game as a game itself, as an experience. Yeah, like, look at all this. It looks great, but... What is going on here? What am I supposed to do? You know what? Screw this ghost. What is happening? There is no barrel! What do they want me to do? <laughs> Just die. I don't care for you, Mickey. What are you gonna do, Pluto? Die? Okay. Oh, my mouse is on the screen. I apologize. I did not realize. Wow, how fun. This is such a good section. Uh, this is my favorite part of the game. I don't even care about the ammo. I don't. Because they somehow make a part that seems cool like this. Not fun. Yeah, there's no way I'm playing the Sega CD version. Bro, after this? Like, what is even going on here? They do you want do you want me to play the Sega CD version after this horror that I'm experiencing here? There is no way to dodge the enemy. I'm just dying and getting murdered. Bruh. Why is he drowning? Why is he just stopping there? Am I stuck? Is this supposed to happen? What? What is? I don't remember this happening in the other games. Shut up, Mickey. I'm trying to figure out what to do. Okay. One life. If I die, I don't know. I'll just use a password to skip this level. Not the best move, but. I, this is the stupid. I should be getting past this easily. Ow. Ow. 
the water goes up way too fast for me to even react to jumping. Like, they want me to jump pretty much immediately. And even if I do, I might, like, why? Do you see this guy? He sucks. Okay. Who thought of this? I need to talk to them. Bro, I'm throwing hands with some designer from Chadley Sales right now. What? You're- I literally exhausted all of my hit points um, for no reason, because I don't know what I was supposed to do there. Okay, we're at the end of the level, thankfully. This level isn't really that long. Compared to a mad doctor. Oh yeah, the Super Nintendo version did this crap too. The enemies corner you in both games. Wait, no, no. I wasn't- Okay, I have one hit left. What am I supposed to do? No! <laughs> no! Okay, I got this. I don't care how much I spawn. I'm jumping over their dumbass hats. Bro. You think you're so smart? Stupid ghost. Oh my god, it's just the same thing over and over again. Who thought this was a good idea? Who thought putting the ghost so close to Mickey was a good idea too? Bruh, okay. I'm angry, beyond it, frustrated with these ghosts. Wait, I can just stand on the table and avoid them? Is that what I'm supposed to do? No, because they corner you too much, and you're just dead. Okay. You know what? You're, you're done. I'm- I- I got- I- I beat you. Don't even try anymore. Okay, you're done. I beat you. Get screwed, bro. Go, Mickey. Rejoice and celebrate. You have won the day. You got one hit point. Good job, bro. Oh god, this part too? Okay, this part's easy. I lied. Yeah, okay, we're on Mickey and the Beanstalk now. And if all goes well, this level should take like 10 minutes, and the next one takes like 20 minutes. Uh, I mean Prince of the Popper. I don't know how long the band, the band one will be. Here, let me look up how to get that real quick, because I don't remember. Okay, it's after this one part where the plants grow, 
and then you jump on a very specific bug. Okay, wait. Oh, there's a switch. And then a bug appears. A bunch of bugs appear that you have to jump on, and then there's that. Because I'm supposed to know about all that somehow. Anyway, back to the game. We're gonna beat it. But not before a game over on purpose. Oh yeah, there's not even any game over music in the other game. The this NES version. Oh, I'm back to 10 ammo. Okay, you know what? No, the, 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 those are just as annoying to dodge. Well, almost. The music is so nice in this version. Honestly, this might be my favorite. Although, the Super Nintendo version did have good music. I remember complimenting it too. Saying it, it sounded less generic than the PS1 somehow. It just has a nice seasoning vibe on the Genesis, I don't know. For this song, for example. Kill the bugs. They may seem innocent and friendly, but they're out to get me. What the he- okay. Listen, Dragonfly Man. I will not tolerate your abuse. You are not to disrespect Mickey Mouse like this. Dude. Not funny. This is so fun. Thrilling gameplay. <laughs> oh, I could have skipped through all of that if if the game would just let me live. I just did that the whole time. Okay, well then I would just fall. Okay, I, I found the secret. Just duck. Oh my god, help me. Do you see this crap? Bro, what the heck do they want me to do here? Gosh dang it. Also, they're just, their sounds are annoying. Like, good for you, you sound like a bee. Or something. They're like impossible to hit because they move around like that. I never had the problem on this section in the other version, so I'm just gonna blame Sega. It's their fault for losing the console roar. Okay. Next part, no loading. I still hate that enemy placement. 
Let's die. Legit, what are you supposed to do to dodge these guys? I'm gonna have to go way out of your way to get. <laughs> Excuse me. Dying. Okay. You know what? I never tried to run away here. This is like boss music playing, like this is a boss. Uh -oh. What? Uh -oh. So, are you saying... Uh, wait. Uh -oh. No? Uh -oh. You're expected to just outrun it? No, it, it legit insta-kills you. And all you can do is go on this guy? Why do they have all the stars? Random fast ladybug is my favorite Mickey Mouse character. Oh! Oh, this is where I can get to the band concert. Because, I don't know, it's just there. It doesn't make, it doesn't have to make sense. Deal with it. Also, I'll also, um, get to it in <laughs> Super Nintendo, I mean, the Sega, Sega Genesis. This isn't in the Super Nintendo, because they are lame. found a time warp to a secret bonus level. Oh, well, the fact they call it a bonus level makes me think that it's not very long, but... The band concert. Yo, the 3D is so cool. Okay, I'm beginning to think this level isn't that good. I mean, at least it's platforming and it has cool 3D effects. Gotta weigh it. Yep. Apparently so. I mean, I don't know how else you would make a level out of the band concert other than just have a the part with the tornado. I mean, where's all the band members that were flying in the air? That'd be nice to have. Okay, honestly, this level's kind of boring. And the music... I mean, for a level called the band concert, the music's kind of... Um, mid as hell? Like, what is this? You just jump on boxes and wait for them to move. That's the best you can do for the bonus level, bro? Don't get me wrong, though. It is a cool secret. Oh, okay. You know what? Okay, that that is pretty... Bonus Sonub. Mickey is bound band, le band leader Mickey. Have an extra continue. Um, actually, he should be called the band concert Mickey. Bro gave me an extra continue? Wow. Okay. That, that was cool, honestly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the level select in the PS1, too. But after the stream's done. If I have time. If I don't, then I'll just include it in, like, a... 
I mean, it doesn't have to be on a stream. It could just be a random thing in the recording that I have for the VOD on YouTube. But yeah, so far this this version's pretty good. I like the difficulty improvements. The bones don't bone me as much, for example. This... It's impressive to me how exactly the same the graphics look, though, between the Super Nintendo and this. I mean, yeah, I know I made fun of the background effect not being present in Snoobot Willy, but otherwise, like, this tree looks the same. Or, like, Mickey looks the same. All the enemies, everything about the enemies and other things is the same. The only thing that's really different graphically is the PS1 version, which adds a lot of cool, like, filters and, like, shading and detail to the world. To make it stand out more. Okay, what, what am I supposed to do? Oh, I see now. Why is there so many bugs? Okay. You know what, I, I might, in a later stream, I also might just actually go back to the PS1 version of this and level select to the last level and beat that again because I'm a completionist, I need to beat every version of Mickey Mania. So I guess CD will come later this year though, because I am tired, I need the rest to save the grand finale for later. Oh my god, you suck. Just die. Die, Michael. Which... Also, I don't remember the music being this annoying in this area. It was more whimsical, I think. There's a giant chase here in this version, I wonder. Wait, where, where's the jiggly effect? Okay, so maybe only... <laughs> maybe only the Sega CD has that, I guess. I mean, to be fair, that might be a bit of an advanced effect for them to pull off. What is Pluto doing? Wait, was Pluto always there? I don't remember him. I do not remember Pluto here. Also, I don't like that they're touching that citrus with their butt. No, no giant. Just a prince and a popper. I wonder why they even wanted to make this game. Did they just want to make Mickey relevant again? Honestly, they could have put Runaway Brain with a Goofy movie, and it would have made sense. Because, like, I mean, that's a Mickey Mouse family related movie. Okay, yeah, there's not a beautiful snow shape in the background of this one either. Which, like, fair. I had more room for that in... PlayStation Land.
This song is better than the, the Super Nintendo one. It's the same song, but... Pete looks just as goofy uh, as he does in the others. Honestly, this is the only really truly fun level. Like, I don't know, I have fun actually killing these weasels. Uh, for once, the enemies aren't annoying as hell. These guys are tolerable. And it's in a short I don't even recognize. I never saw this. So. Platforming is decent. Killing enemies is fine. And heck, I don't even have to kill all of them to get pie. Ah, okay. Did I say that? No, you gotta kill that guy. Muds, kill that guy and spin him around. Muds, kick that guy in the ball. He should have been able to just, just... No! Why are you doing this? Okay, you know what? Screw you, dude. Stop hitting Mickey. Never mind, this game doesn't earn my praises anymore. Right? No. Better platforming first, and then that part. Fine. Honestly, you know what game I should play that I've actually played as a kid? Hercules on the PlayStation 1. I remember that having pretty good, like, awesome looking graphics, and it was pretty cool. I never got past the first stage, though. I don't remember who made that game, either. But, I'm sure it was magical. Oh my god. Do they shoot faster or something in this version? I, I swear, they shot way slower. 
Okay, as much as I said this version is easier, there's also some things that seem more bullshit. Like, what? That did not happen. That, that was not in Super Nintendo or PlayStation, I swear. I swear on my great grandmom. Oh well. I swear on me mum. Uh, no. Kidding, right? What is going on? Oh, okay. I'm back here. Good. I need to recalculate whatever happened. Okay, this is getting a little annoying, but it's fine. for some reason. How do you open it? Is there a button? not there. I swear. That was not there. Okay, whatever. Get. Oh god. I can't see. Ow. Ow. Uh -oh. 
Bro, screw it all. I don't even want to fight them. Like, at all. I'm just so bored. Bro, these enemies are making me so tired. Are they harder here? Oh, wait, what? Oh, I was gonna say the window disappeared, and that's bad. Okay, fine, take it one at a time. How did anybody beat this game without save states? This was- this is a hellish game. Definitely one of the hardest games I've ever played, honestly. It's fucking like, general difficulty. I mean, it's not a cuphead, yeah, but... And like... Far from the hardest game ever, but damn, is it, like, annoying? I, I definitely probably would not be able to beat it if I wasn't using the safe states, which is fine. Like, I don't care. It's Nikki Mania, like... I just want to be able to get to the end of the game, so... So close. Dun 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 this. I don't got this. Oh yeah. Getting close to the end section. Right. This song is good. Actually, isn't this the final boss song? I don't know what's better, this or the Super Nintendo version. 
both make me actually happy I'm at the end of the game now. Like, this is a final boss bop. Worthy of the Mickey Mania name. Okay, that was so much easier than both versions. I think. I, I don't remember. I remember it being more difficult. And I know this isn't just because I'm better at the game. Because no. That's not it. It just was easier. Oh god. I'm gonna have difficulty here still though. This is hell. Wow, this is a good song too. I don't even remember- Oh my god, no. Stop. Why? Okay. No! Oh my god, help me. If this game help this game sucks, never mind. I, I hate it and it sucks. Yup, that's that's the truth. Actually, it's much more complicated than that with Mickey Mania. It's weird. You do you see this bullcrap? No. I don't know why I played this. Imagine me playing Castlevania. That, that, that would be funny. Oh. Oh. I got it. I got it. I don't got it. How do they expect me to kill enemies in that quicker succession without, dodge, without getting hit by their attacks? Bro, that was insane. Oh, whoa, 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 he's swinging, like... I used to be a mouse like you, but then I took an arrow to the knee. The swinging is a lot faster. Mickey just wants to rush and get out of here. That's all Mickey wants to do. Let him live. Let him see the light of day. Oh my god, it looks like that guy's about to get murdered. Look at him. No. No, you, you, you took? Why doesn't jumping kill these guys? Uh, can this be a normal platform game? Why do I have to throw stupid marbles? To kill anybody. Cool. Can you not have super... Require superhuman reflexes of dodge, please? Please? Like, God, I'm like a fraction of a second too late to jump. I'm gonna be Pete, though. Okay, we're, we're, we're near the end. Like, actually. Yes! Yes, that's the final boss! Yes, okay. That's, this is it, guys. Wait, isn't this the regular ass boss theme? Are you kidding me? This is what I fly for? 
Okay. Well, I have no health. You know what? Mickey, just die. You stand no chance. Actually, I don't know if it'll reset or not. No, you know what? No, I'd rather have the full health. Okay, all or nothing. We have one thing of health, one continue left, one life, or whatever. Yeah, this is not the final boss song. I can't believe they ruined it for the Genesis version. The Super Nintendo version actually has an original theme for the final boss. It's actually really good. It was the song that played on the stairs in this version. That song is much more fitting. I'm sorry, why would you use the regular boss theme? should have got hit by that. It just didn't count it because it wasn't right dead on in the hitbox. Wait, he actually talks? I mean, okay, the battle isn't nearly as cool without the right music, but I'm still not going to say it's bad. Cause it's still kind of fun, actually. This is like a Mario boss type beat or something. I don't know. Okay, I'm doing pretty good, actually. I save. Where do all these spike pits even come from? Oh, oh, now they're playing the song. Yes. Okay. I didn't know. I think. I think in the Super Nintendo version they played this song. Uh, the whole time. Okay, you know what? The transition is cool here. Maybe that's how it was supposed to be. I mean, this... Uh, Super Nintendo was a port, after all. This was the first version they made of the game. You bastard, Pete. What? What? Explain to me how am I supposed to dodge all the stars and his sword at the same time? Do they want me to die here? And then, at, to top that, they want me to jump on that thing, too. You know what? Just take the hit. Am I not supposed to get health? No, I just have to be that fast. Why does he have wrecking balls in the middle of his room to hit him with? Is he stupid? Why does he keep doing that? I'm gonna run out of health for sure. Okay, you know what? That's why they put the stars on the wall. They knew he was cheap. They knew he was a cheap bastard. Doesn't matter. Kill him. I mean, it's possible to dodge on this side. It's like... 
all you have to do is that. And he doesn't wait until throw out the sword until after he's done with that. Why is it only on the right side of the room? He's like, I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, literally, I'm stuck in a corner. Oh my god. Honestly, I like the Super Nintendo version of the song more, though. Okay, how many more hits does this guy have? I need to beat this. Run out of time here. We got this. Bruh, Mickey, please. You know what? I have a feeling he's about to be dead, so I'm fine. Yeah! Kicking his butt is so satisfying. Well done, Mickey. Mighty Pete has been defeated. Did you find the Madden Docker in the band concert? Yeah, I did, actually. Yeah! I beat Mickey Mania! Oh, uh, things not on the screen, is it? Mad Doctor. Anyway, yeah, it's a pretty good game. Just really annoying, but... concert be here? I don't know. Okay. We got the giant spoiler. I wonder if that was actually a Mickey and the Beanstalk. I don't, I don't... No! They don't even have the band concert, even though I worked so hard to get it. At least they got the banging music again. And that's it! I beat Mickey Mania. Thank you everyone for watching. If you like what you saw, feel free to follow and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Links on the sidebar. I post all my Twitch mods there, including a ton of other content like Mario, Sonic the Hedgehog, Kingdom Hearts, Pikmin 4, and a lot of other licensed games. So if that sounds cool, feel free to check that out. Anyway, have yourselves a fantastic day and shake yeah. Oh wait, the credits are still here. But um, yeah, cool game. Honestly, I don't really need to watch the credits. It's the same music. Cool, okay. Anyway, see y'all everyone on the next stream. Gonna probably play Nick Ball 2 again, I don't know, until I beat that. Don't really have much. I, I just want to play that as like an in-between game right now, you know? Anyway, see ya.